lacking on your granny sofa. Home alone, and he about to roll. All right, coming up next, it's a light heavyweight championship fight between Daniel Cormier and Jan Wachowicz. All right, here he is making his way to the octagon and looking to leave as the new UFC light heavyweight champion. He is the number one ranked 205 pound contender and is finally realizing the title fight here tonight. He believes he has a lot of advantages in this fight. He believes he's the better man. Look at the confidence on his face. No UFC jitters for this man. He is out to prove tonight that this champion is a one trick pony and that he is the best light heavyweight on the planet. We'll see if he can turn those words into actions here in short order. So here he is, the UFC light heavyweight champion of the world, looking to walk out the same way he is walking in tonight as the undisputed reigning defending champion. No doubt this man walks in as the best 205 pounder in the world. He proved it when he won the belt, proved it when he has defended it since. Now the question is, as the challenges get stiffer, Joe, is he still the best in the world? A lot of people think he is. We'll get our answer in short order. Daniel Cormier is one of the best wrestlers to ever compete in the UFC's heavyweight division. And with that work ethic, he has brought his striking up to an elite level as well. He is amongst the very best in the sport. Our tale of the tape for this lightweight championship fight. Four years apart, some differences in height and reach as well. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds, the undisputed UFC light heavyweight championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a Muay Thai fighter, holding a professional record of 23 wins, 7 losses. He stands 62 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Warsaw, Poland, presenting the challenger, John Blackowicz. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a wrestler, holding a professional record of 22 wins, 1 loss, and 1 no contest. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of San Jose, California, he is the reigning, defending UFC light heavyweight champion of the world, Daniel D.C. This is for the UFC Championship. I want you to be my commands at all times. Protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back to corners, come out fight. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in, because right, it's about to go ready? down right so now. All right, here we go. UFC light heavyweight title is on the line. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Clean Superman punch. Could get really interesting. Oh, beautiful, beautiful right hand by the champion. And he executed a very nice sweep here and wound up in guard. Effective punch there by DC. And mounts again. Full mount. 
too much time fighting off of your back, Joe, but pretty good work here from the bottom by Blahovic. Big punch from the bottom. Back to side control. And Dizzy as he looks to improve position here. Looks like he's going for a choke. It looks like he's got the north-south choke locked in nice and tight. He might have to tap any second now. This north-south choke is getting very, very tight. He got it, he got it. Oh. Nicely done. Great job, didn't waste any time. Took this fight to the ground and got the early submission. Yeah, so a quick night at the office for him here tonight. He told us he wanted to be efficient. He didn't want to waste a lot of time. He felt his opponent knew the takedown attempts would be coming, and he got the fight to the ground relatively easily, and his submission skills then took over. Big, big result for him early in round one tonight. And here it is again, absolutely perfectly executed. And finally, one more time. We send it in there now to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliata has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 21 seconds of the very first round. Deploying the winner by tap out. And still.